Hi there, this is Victoria from CrushCrypto.com. In this video, I will be covering a blockchain project called DChain Network. As always, we are not paid or mandated to do any of our reviews. This is just our personal opinion and analysis for educational purposes only and not financial advice. Please always do your own research before making any investment decisions. DChain is developing a decentralized big data and machine learning network. The project is based on the premise that data is valuable and data creators should be able to own and benefit from their own data. The team aims to tackle major big data issues such as privacy, ownership and security while supporting business intelligence and machine learning applications. With DChain's decentralized data exchange platform, users will be able to own and control their own data and securely trade and analyze data. Utilizing blockchain technology featuring multi-nodes and distributed storage, the costs of data retrieval and storage would also be reduced significantly. DChain is based on a chains-on-chain -chain architecture, which includes one master chain and two side chains. The structure was designed as such in order to solve multiple issues related to data computation, storage, and privacy issues. This would otherwise be difficult to do simultaneously using only one chain. The idea for the structure was inspired by Lightning Network, which features a second layer payment protocol on top of a blockchain. It was also inspired by Hadoop, a centralized big data platform that was developed by the Apache Software Foundation, where one of the team members worked previously. The three chains on DChain's platform are each responsible for storing different information. The master chain stores asset information and events such as states, transactions, receipts, and contracts. The master chain uses proof of work to provide the highest level of security and stability. The data sidechain stores non-asset information or metadata and serves as a method of storage retrieval. The computation sidechain stores specific computing tasks performed on DChain and is responsible for recording matching processes of computation, such as whether a certain task can be completed or not. The DChain platform has several key technical features. Verification game enables any computational task to be performed securely while minimizing the number of network no computations required. Provable data computation allows the network to verify the accuracy of computation results. This is used by the computation chain to verify the authenticity of results and reduces the prevalence of false information. Proof of space time and provable data possession is used as the consensus protocol of storage. The data chain uses these to verify processes and to prevent various types of attacks that might bring down the network. And finally, DChain not only provides the data storage function, but also gives the flexibility of retrieving files at a more granular scale. This slide summarizes the project's historical milestones and future development roadmap. DChain Network is still in working process with the MVP currently set to launch sometime in July. According to the CTO, a test chain could be launched in the next few months and its official network could be released early next year. TrustLuck, which is the AI-based security firm founded by one of the co-founders, will be the first application to be added to DChain. DChain will be raising funds by issuing DX tokens. The token will initially be issued as ERC20 tokens after the crowd sale and will be migrated to the DChain mainnet after it is launched. The hard cap is 36,000 Ether, with 30% of the total token supply going to token sale contributors. The fully diluted market cap is $56 million, assuming the current Ether price of $470. The private sale has already been completed, Details on the public token sale will be provided by the team soon. Please visit DChain's website and join their Telegram channels for the most up-to-date information on their upcoming token sale. The DX token is a network's native protocol token. There are several uses for these tokens. First, DX tokens will serve as a secure and primary method of payment between participants in the network. Providers of computational and storage resources required for running various apps and transactions will be rewarded with these tokens. And miners will be rewarded based on the usefulness of work that they passively provide. DX tokens should appreciate in value as more users join and use the network. This is driven by numerous factors, including the number and type of applications available on the platform, user experience, data storage capacity and processing speed, and so on. The team is currently comprised of 10 people based in San Francisco. The project is currently hiring multiple positions according to the career page. The biographies of the key team members are summarized here on this slide. Advisors of the project include the professor of CEIBS, the founder of BlockBC, 
the founding partner of Preangel, and the partner of Ancoin and former founding partner of Sequoia Capital China. Investors of the project include Preangel, Bambushi Digital, Block VC, Node Capital, Signum Capital, JRR Crypto, Vision Capital, and others. Here are some of our thoughts on the project's opportunities. First of all, concerns over data ownership and privacy is becoming more and more prevalent around the world. The recent enactment of the GDPR in the EU shows how serious the issue has become for both individuals and governments on the legitimate collection and use of personal data. If the team is successful in decentralizing Hadoop, a distributed file storage and computation solution, we believe it provides substantial potential. And finally, the team has a strong technical background and relevant working experience in the fields of big data, distributed systems, blockchain research, network security, and so on. As for our concerns, first of all, proof of space time is still a new concept, and no established blockchain is currently using it. It is unclear at the moment whether this concept will ultimately work or not. While proof of space time does not require expensive mining hardware, there is still the concern that a rich player, such as the nation state or a manufacturer that enjoys cost advantages, could employ a large amount of storage and get to sign most blocks. Second, multiple key members of the team are still working at Trustlook. We are unsure how they will be allocating their time between these two ventures going forward. Overall, we have a positive view on this ICO for flipping. The project has average market awareness for the time being, but has a strong team, good idea, and relatively attractive token metrics. With the backing of numerous well-known investors, we believe the project will be able to get listed on decent exchanges and have unmet demand following the token sale. For long-term holding, we have a neutral view. The project is very ambitious in that it focuses on both data storage and computation, as well as the migration of Hadoop to a decentralized environment. It also aims to provide the world's largest storage space. If the project can achieve its vision, its potential could be substantial, with lots of decentralized apps potentially benefiting from DeChain. On the other hand, while the team is very impressive, there is not much work that has been released publicly yet. We are looking forward to their MVP, which is set to launch in the near future. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If you haven't already, please subscribe to our YouTube channel or follow us on Twitter and Facebook to get our latest updates. We publish new content on various projects and cryptocurrencies on a regular basis. Hope you're having a great day and keep crushing it.